morning and happy Thursday everybody it is half seven and Owen is still asleep which is mad um, came out this morning at seven thinking it's strange that James is meant to be away but Alfie I can hear Alfie and I can't hear Owen um, came down turned out James came down at six with Alfie and I didn't realize it was seven so he's finishing to get ready now Alfie is in his little play um, ring. Hello, baby. And I'm going to show you what I got from my calendars today. Um, so the tea of the day is aromatic black chai. I got another little uh, chocolate square. And I got Christmas garland. And I'm so excited because I love the scent of this. Um, and no me tonight, uh, tonight, today is here if, if the camera would focus on him. There we go. Um, I actually um, realized this morning at 7 that I hadn't put him in a different place. So that's why I came down basically. Um, but yeah, um, there's not much planned for today. Owen is actually doing his Christmas show today and tomorrow the hole in the school is not big enough to accommodate all the parents from there is the show from three first classes uh, in the school but for each level there is two classes so <coughs> they have to uh, accommodate enough parents so what they are doing is that they are doing the show on like, this morning and tomorrow morning and uh, then half of the parents come today and half tomorrow uh, we're going tomorrow which is good because that's the day James had off anyway for his hospital appointment so it works out great I'm really looking forward to that I know all the songs because he's been uh, practicing them a lot um, but um, yeah and Alfie really enjoyed the songs too so I'm sure you will like it James is about to go to work <laughs> you're awake now <laughs> Okay. <laughs> kind of. Do you want a chocolate for the road in your calendar? Oh, yes. <coughs> <coughs> okay. And I think now we're going to try and escape in a second. If you can gather up the energy first. Yeah, he's, he's tired, but. <laughs> oh. He didn't wake up during the night. Again? Second night in a row. Woohoo! Did you not wake up in the night, baby? That's very good. That's very good, baby. Yeah. Oh, when he's now waking up, so James is gonna go and get him so he can give him a hug before he goes to work. Last night I did one coat on one hand and never painted the other one. I need to paint the second coat on this one and. Um, yeah. And it's very well because my ponytail is tiny. Um, I am going to just <coughs> fix my hair and get dressed and um, then get the boys ready to go to school. He's awake now. Good morning. Where is he? Did he climb up on the new star? Yeah. Oh, no, me. <laughs> Hmm? He must like the view from up there. Yeah. Did you have a big sleep on? Yeah, a while we did. Yeah, you had a very big one. Yeah. You have a hug for daddy before he goes? I did. Another one. <laughs> oh, I'm going to come home and I'll see you tonight. I'll see you today. Yes, later today. I know, but I'll be back before you go to bed. Why? And tomorrow morning, Daddy doesn't have to go to work. Do you know where Daddy is going tomorrow morning? Why? He's going with Mommy and Alfie to your school to see the Christmas show. <laughs> it's now five past six, and usually by the time one is dressed and I am dressed and well, Alfie's going to stay in his pyjamas for now and today we're just still in pyjamas when he's still eating his breakfast and yeah so I have a feeling it's going to be a rush at the end but for the minute 
well might as well enjoy it. When can you explain why you're gonna bring this to school? Into the basket. To put in the basket? And who are you gonna give the basket to after? Easter. To people who don't have a lot of food? So they can eat for Christmas? Yeah. So they are doing a, like a food bank collection in this class. Uh, so we're going to bring some pea, tins of peas and a packet of pasta. And we'll put them in the basket, won't we? No, but we won't. I not have to buy some. No, but we have loads. I've bought those especially for that. Okay. It's time for the Playmobil calendar. Let's do it here. And which number do we need to find a win? Three. So, three is here. Yep. Yeah. Oh, okay. I got two little badgers and cauliflowers. We are now off to school. Alfie is asleep in his uh, little car seat, so I'm going to bring the chassis that it can click on so I don't have to wake him up. He doesn't have a coat on, so I'm going to have to <laughs> make do with a lot of blankets on him because it's freezing outside. Just back home, and I'm about uh, to give Alfie his breakfast because he's ready and he's very, very hungry. You hungry, baby? Do you want some banana porridge? Yes. I'm facing his jumper and it's happy enough, so I'm just going to make myself a cup of coffee and some breakfast. I'm actually going to light my Christmas garden candle. Then I am hoping I can get quite a bit of work done this morning, but it will depend on this little guy mostly. But he seems in quite a good mood. He had a good nap there for about 45 minutes. Um, so he's probably going to delay his nap, morning nap, because of that. They had all his breakfast. He's all happy. I have a little guy who doesn't want to sleep yet. <laughs> um, I've just thought of something. It's not big. It's a um, pack of chalk markers, white chalk markers. Um, I've got them because I, um, I've been wanting to decorate my windows for Christmas. And it's been about three years I've been looking for snowflake, uh, kind of either like window clings or... I have some jelly decorations, a bit like I had for Halloween, but they're starting to look a bit bleh. I probably will use them anyway. Um, but uh, I was gonna, f I was trying to find some window clings, like just plain white snowflakes, just to cover all my windows, but they st mm. still wouldn't let, you know, would let the light in and all. And I can't find some that I really like, so. I figured uh, a pack of three markers on Amazon is about six pounds. So I decided to order some liquid chalk markers because you can write on glass with them and then you can clean it afterwards. And I'm just gonna draw my own. So they should be here on Saturday. So at the weekend, I will be drawing things on my windows. Hey, Grumpy. Hey, Grumpy, Grumpy. Hey, little Grumpy. Little Grumpy. So I'm gonna try and get this baby to sleep to be able to film my um, swap video. <laughs> Hopefully it does happen. I'm going to give him a bit of oh. milk now because usually oh. that helps him go to sleep. I've now filmed um, a little clip for each swap with the contents of everything I've put in the parcels. So now it's the fun time of wrapping everything and I'm really excited about that actually to make all the parcels pretty. I hope. It's always, I always worry when I do swaps that like, did I get enough, or did I get it right, or... Um, it's always very hard when you just swap with somebody. I've never, ever been disappointed about what I got. Um, it's not really about the quantity, really, I find. But um, I just wouldn't want somebody just to be disappointed with what I sent. So I kind of usually go with what I would like to get. Um, like, if I was doing a swap with somebody, I kind of go for things I like myself, because... I think you can't really go wrong with something you like. Well, I hope. Anyway, I am going to wrap everything now. I will probably give you a little sneak peek uh, once I have wrapped it all because it probably will look very pretty and it means um, I will not show what's in the parcels, but uh, for the mummy swap, the girl can actually have a little sneak peek without knowing anything at all, but having a little idea, but it will be very quick because I don't want to spoil it. So there's the mommy swap parcel. Um, well, I need to get a bigger box, but that's everything wrapped. And I have also wrapped everything for the Soft Exchanger uh, parcel as well. I'm going to put them in a box. Now, I need to buy a big bubble envelope uh, for these. 
and I have already set a bigger box aside for those so I'm gonna wrap that now so something really interesting happened um, I spent the whole morning doing some work cutting fabric um, um, packing all the parcels and all that and this little guy in the meantime was sleeping I didn't I can't remember what time it was when he fell asleep probably sometime around 11 or so but uh, it's only when he stirred at 20 to 2 that I realized it was time to go to school and I don't know what would have happened if he didn't stir because it went so fast and I'm just not used at all to him oh. not um, waking up like for such a long time that um, probably would have been very late to pick up Owen. Thankfully we don't live far and I was able to make it there on time. Um, uh, but yeah, he just slept so well. I just can't believe it because he slept probably about over two and a half hours, which is amazing. It's very good, baby. You can do that every day if you want. Because now you're such a happy baby. So I just picked him up, put him in the buggy, and left because I basically had five minutes to pick him up and get to school. So I ran down. It's yeah. raining so much. So. You have Oh, let me see. Well, we're going to leave it open for the minute or one because uh, we're going to have to empty the rubbish from it, okay? Yeah. Well, um, one's trying to get help with his lunchbox um, to get his water out. But um, yeah, I just can't believe it. It's just, it, uh, and the rain is so bad. So tomorrow morning, um, always starts school at nine, but the, and it's played at half nine. But the teacher advised for us to just go straight into the class, uh, into the um, hall after, so then we could get seats um, because they expect a lot of people to turn up, but I'm really excited to go and see his play. We're going to see his play and the ones from uh, P1 and P2 as well. It's like the next two levels up in school. Um, it's very different in Northern Ireland from the rest of the UK um, and wherever you are but basically Owen is in the first class which is nursery um, and then there's P1 Ow. which is primary one Alfie! He <laughs> just had a massive burp Alfie! I got a burpy baby! <laughs> um, and primary two so basically kids from three, four to six, seven? Five, five, six years old. Well, between three and six, basically. But um, from the pictures I've seen, some are doing a Frozen show, some are doing a nativity one, or when he's doing some form of nativity play, um, with which is set in a farm with animals. And yeah, I don't think I will be able to film. I'm going to try and see if I can film Owen on his own or even blur the other children, but I don't know how much of it I'm going to be able to show just because uh, I don't want to put uh, videos of other people's children without their permission, of course. So um, I'll, I'll see how much I can get and um, try and include even something to show you, even maybe a picture of him. Uh, he's a shepherd, but um, they don't have full costumes. They have kind of props with their uniforms for the youngest ones. So uh, he's just going to have a tea towel on his head with um, something else. I can't remember. So I'll show you that tomorrow. So we've bought Owen. Can you move back Owen so I can film you? Why? Oh. Who move, you move. Um, because in the school one, he gets soaked. Uh, we have got him like a waterproof uh, onesie kind of thing so then he can be all dry or he can wear that over his clothes and he doesn't get soaked on the way to school and back so I got that on Amazon for $8.99 I think it was um, I'll check the price for you and let you know but it's a lot of the kids have that and I thought it's actually a very good idea because we always walk to school and um, I have several colors, but I decided to go for yellow because I thought at least he can be seen uh, easily and the cows can see him too. I'm trying to show you something cute Alfie does, but I don't know if he will do it on command. Oh, when can you move a minute? I'm trying to film Alfie. Oh, oh, no. Alfie, cuckoo! Uh -huh. okay, so see the way he goes with his hand? That's his way of waving. It's not like a proper wave. Alfie, cuckoo! <laughs> Cuckoo, baby! <laughs> I 
I think I'm gonna have to raise the jumper to the highest size because his legs are starting to get very long for this. I'm gonna do that now and see if he's any more comfortable with the long cuckoo. <laughs> and look at Hello baby. And me. Hello Owen. We're playing together. Don't squish him, okay? <laughs> what are you playing? Why, oh, when we're going to make him dizzy. Why? Oh. <laughs> Are you being a, a wobbly baby? <laughs> <laughs> so, you can, you can, you can also get in and watch me play. Can you? God, I think he's really stuck. <gasps> Boom! <laughs> what happened, baby? He's really, can you see? He's really, he's really trying to crawl, but... <laughs> That's what he does, he moves his bum. He's trying to go on all fours though. I just got the jumper off, but I don't know if it's because he doesn't want to be in it, but he doesn't seem very happy. Baby! Is it less fun? He can't jump as high. He can't jump as high anymore. But I'm going to try and feed him. He might be getting tired again actually. I might have another nap. I have a little friend who just woke up after an hour and a half. And another friend here. Lots of little friends. Well, how is Alfie being today? Really, really, really good all morning. And all afternoon as well. Yeah, that means you can, can you get another surprise. Can you get two surprises then? Yeah. What kind of surprises do we get him? Um, we get um milk and noodles and presents. Okay. Alfie is escaped. Where are you going? What are you going to do under the tree? <laughs> what are you doing under the tree? Get out of the tree. Get out of there. What are you doing? Up. We rescued him! Yay! <laughs> I got him on this back! Hold on, I'm going to move him again because I think he's probably going to end up under the tree again. So I'm having a little bit of these moments where I need to find the motivation to do stuff. But I can't. Um, I kind of need to go to Tesco. It's because I need to buy stuff to make sandwiches for when's lunch tomorrow. I need to buy a big padded envelope to send my Australian swap uh, parcel tomorrow. And I could potentially have the option to do all this tomorrow. But there's already loads and loads to do then. And I know that I would be glad if I get it done tonight. So there's one less thing to do tomorrow. But right now, to be honest, the thought of leaving the house at almost 8 o'clock and get in the car and drive to Tesco's and back is not really a good idea. But I know I will regret it if I don't do it. Um, tomorrow we have to um, go to Belfast to the hospital for James because he has to get a scan. Um, because it's been one year he had his surgery to remove his tumor he has to have a scan to check that he's still in the all clear tumor wise <coughs> so that's uh, in the afternoon so James's mom is going to pick Owen in school and um, he uh, is going to go to some sort of Christmas party with her so I'm sure he will love that there will be Santa and all that so at least he will have fun while we are doing some boring hospital stuff for a change and we're going to bring Alfie with us because it's just simpler to have him instead of uh, James's mom having him and not being able to uh, enjoy the Christmas party as much um, so yeah um, I'm going to get wrapped up I think and go 
Although I would feel like putting my pyjamas on and a nice candle and sticking some food on. I'm going to go and get... I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to get something nice for dessert. I was gonna. I was thinking in my head I'd get some, a nice breakfast for tomorrow morning, but James will have to fast. So it's not very nice to do that to him, really. So I am going to get something nice for dessert and... Um, then I'll just stick some frozen food in the oven uh, when I'm back, I think, just so we have something quick. Yeah, time to put a coat on and find my motivation somewhere on the way as well. I'm now back home uh, after going to Tesco's. I've put some frozen pizzas in the oven um, and I've got everything I need to finish to wrap my parcels, so I'm going to do that now. I've also got, while I was on my own without a win, some wrapping paper to wrap uh, the rest of the Christmas presents because I used most of mine uh, today and a few stocking fillers for him as well I got some of the little um, Playmobil uh, like surprise bag character and I also got some uh, little cards because he started to get uh, cards from his friends in school so I got like a pack of uh, 20 and there were 3 for 2 so I got another pack like this and I found a gnome themed selection box so these are mine <laughs> but um, yeah I am going to rub the parcels while the pizzas are cooking and then probably eat edit the vlog and go to bed so I'm gonna stop it now and I will see you tomorrow for another vlog bye